Good evening, this innovative idea rolled out for the first time today at Chicago's Lee Elementary and it gives students real money so they can research and execute stock trades while earning money for their own college tuition. So is this one of your favorite classes? For kids on the southwest side, it's a game changer. We're going to be giving each grade $20,000 to invest. Chicago investment banker Martin Cabrera Jr. with partner Robert Aguilar, both of them Chicago Public School products, the architects of the new plan, with enthusiastic support from Illinois treasurer Michael Fryricks. The budget. What's the budget of Sophia? The $20,000 for each classroom energizing financial literacy instruction at Richard Henry Lee Elementary on the southwest side of Chicago from kindergarten to eighth grade. I think it's a great opportunity for us. Lee students thrilled to hear the news. Maybe someday you'll be in working at the stock market. I hope. That's the goal. Braulio Asense sharing his excitement with CPS School CEO Pedro Martinez, who is pleased to see students learning about the stock market and mortgage rates. But they're also talking about budgets, how to use resources, how to save money in a bank account, how to invest. The first hurdle, though, is getting parents and students to open a Bright Start Illinois 529 college savings program, difficult to do for working families struggling to pay bills. It is hard, and I think we wanted to kick start it by giving each of the students $100 to start on top of the $20,000 for each class. Half of the $20,000 goes to the state treasurer and the Illinois 529 savings program. And the other half, the $10,000, they'll be able to go and research stocks and invest in those stocks. The real money heightening the experience and the learning for Lee Elementary students, especially as they watch their stock portfolio grow. So when they graduate from eighth grade, half of the money of the proceeds, the profits, will go towards their 529 plan, and the other half will go back to the school, and the 20000 will be reinvested back into the kindergarten class. We really wanted to build a program that was sustainable. Many of Lee Elementary's hardworking parents didn't go to college. The hope is that the students will teach their own parents financial literacy. In the newsroom, Julian Cruz, WGN News.